see you. Are you okay? It must have been so scary being grabbed by Franco. Yeah, I mean, I've had better days. <laughs> I was really worried about you. I mean, you're my sister and I love you, and selfishly speaking, I can't imagine my life without you to confide in. Well, that's really sweet. So you're really okay? Yeah. I mean, I'm, I, yeah, I'm okay. I think it, it was probably a little bit harder on Jason, you know? But come on, that's not why you called me here. What's going on with you? I need some advice about Kiefer. Okay. Obviously, you and Jason have this great relationship. He loves you and treats you really sweet and wonderful. But does he ever lose his temper out of nowhere or get jealous for no reason? And if so, how do you make him feel better? Hold on, um, hold on a second, Christina, are, who, who are we talking about now? Are we talking about Jason or Kiefer? Most of the time, Kiefer's amazing, kind, considerate, funny, way into me. And when he does get mad, he has a good reason. Like what? usually because of something I've done or haven't done. I'm not always clear. This is my first relationship, and I've made some mistakes. Yeah, um, okay. You gotta listen to me now, okay? If Kiefer makes you feel like you're always in the wrong, you are not in a good relationship. If being with him doesn't build you up and make you feel really good about yourself, you're not getting what you need. That simple? No, no, not at all. I'm not trying to minimize anything. And a relationship between a man and a woman is not that simple. But I know from my own unhealthy relationships, and I can't say it enough, if being with Kiefer makes you feel bad about yourself or like you're doing something wrong, Chrissy, it is no good. You gotta get out.